Hi boys and girls, it's Mr. Anderson again. Hope everyone's doing well and staying safe. Today we're going to be talking about our math for Wednesday. So before we get started, let's make sure that we have a good working pencil and a good working eraser before we get started today. This is the page we're going to be focused on today. You'll know you're on the right page because it says Wednesday right there at the top. Just like always, we want to make sure we put our name on the line there. And you don't have to put the date on it today because we've got the date written right up here. Well, not the date, but the day of the week written right up here on Wednesday. So what we're going to be talking about today is place value. The directions say write the number shown by the base blocks. So I'm going to look. Let's see. I'll start. Um, I'm going to start with this one right here. I'm going to look at my blocks. Now, there are a couple of ways that I can do this. The first way that I can do that takes a very long time and I do not recommend is counting every single one of those little teeny tiny squares. I could do that, or if I use my memory, I can remember, wait a second, when we make our base 10 blocks, this is how we represent the numbers. If it's a square, that's a 100. If it's a straight line, that's a 10. And if it's a little dot, that's a 1. These are very similar. If this is a straight line here, I already know that's a group of 10. So I'll put 10. Now, I don't see any squares like I have right here. So that tells me there's no hundreds. So I'm good there. Now all I have to do is count my ones. I have 1, 2, 3, 4. So I've got 10 plus 4. A lot of us can do that in our head. If not, then you can use some of your strategies to find that out. But I'll go ahead and give you the answer because I'm feeling nice and generous today. That answer is going to be 14. So there are 14 blocks here. You're going to do the exact same thing for the rest of the blocks on this page. That's pretty much it today, boys and girls. It's very simple. If you get a little confused, don't forget you can write those base tens like we've got right up here. You can ask somebody for some help at uh, that's at your house, or you can email one of your teachers and see if they can help you. We are always here and ready to help you if you have any questions. But today, this is just a review of our place value and just kind of to help us remember those base 10 blocks and remember how to count those quickly. So once again, remember, if you see the square or a, a group of blocks in a square, that's 100. That's 10 rows of 10 equals 100. If you see just the straight line, that's one row of 10. That means a 10. And you can count by 10s if you have more than one of those. And if you see 1s, those are easy. You just count by 1s. That's it for today, boys and girls. Hope you guys are staying safe and having a great time. We'll see you tomorrow.